All right, so here we are back on lesson seven. We're going to finish this one up, 7.4, running a presentation. I left off on recording a presentation because I didn't want the video to get too long and be messed up. So uh, it's going to have a little bit of trouble recording my screen and recording uh, the PowerPoint recording the screen. We've got like a, a funky loop going on here, but we'll see what happens. So it says on the slideshow tab in the setup show, you're going to click record slideshow and you're going to say from beginning. Now it's not recording just yet, so we're going to set a couple of things up. First of all, it says make sure that the microphone is turned on. And my microphone is on. And notice we also have a camera preview. We'll leave that one on there so you guys get to see me recording these videos. It's exciting stuff. All right, now ensure that you have, let me move this out of the way. Ensure that you have uh, the highlighter. So select the highlighter and make sure the color for the highlighter is orange. And for the pen, change the pen color to purple. So I'm gonna select the highlighter, so that's the one that's on right now, because once we start recording, we're gonna use the highlighter first. So up here at the top, notice I have a record button. I'm gonna go ahead and click record now and start the loop. So we have a countdown and here it is. Welcome, it says advance through the slides at a regular rate which for me is really fast. When you get to the, uh, let's see, slide four, when you get $780,000, we're gonna use the highlighter to highlight over that, like so. Then click the highlighter button to turn it off. Go to the next slide. Um, on slide five, Make sure you select the pen, and with the pen, you're going to circle 15% in purple. Then pause. Turn the pen off, and record. So we're recording again. Here we have it. It says, um, resume through the rest of the slideshow. And at this point, we are going to just click to exit. Now notice we have the slideshow inside slide sorter view, and there's the timings for each of our slides. Okay. Uh, let's go to slideshow, setup show, or excuse me, make sure it's, we have in the setup group, play narrations, right there, and use timings, check that box, use timings if present, and then click from beginning, and I'm going to stop talking so we don't have a weird loop. Okay, I'm going a little fast to finish that up because you just saw me do it before. Let's move on to the last one here, which says create a custom slideshow. So for this one, up here where it says custom slideshows, you're going to do the drop down menu, custom shows, we don't have one, so click new. 
and we're going to call our new show Investors. Type that in up here with the name. Now it says select the checkbox next to slide one and say add. Notice it runs over here in our custom show. We're also going to add two, three, and five and click add and notice it put them all over there. It did renumber them, but we got all the slides we wanted. Uh, let's see at the click the end of the show. Oh, let's uh, run the show. So click OK. And then notice we can click show now. And it runs through. All right, so we've seen enough of that. Uh, it's a little bit choppy video, but I think we got it. So let's try and uh, submit and see what we get. Come on, Jasper Active, show me 100%. So it's not doing it. I can't record the video. I'm getting these wrong every time and I'm sure I'm doing it right. So we're gonna call this good and I'm gonna stop this video Thank you so much. I'll get my 100% when I do it without recording. Have a good day, and I'll see you at inserting summary Zoom slides.